Hello everyone, welcome back to the OptiShot Academy. I'm Chad. And I'm Ben. All right, putting is where we're focused. Gaining control of the speed is the number one skill we want to work at. So you've been running your experiments, playing around with the size and the speed and the center phase contact, one motion, very, very important. However, there's still another area that we could look, run some more experiments and find out. So Ben, tell us about shaft lean with the putter and how that will influence the speed that the ball goes. Yeah, so the experiment we're gonna run today is we're gonna play around with different amounts of shaft lean. So we have a neutral shaft, slightly forward, moderately forward, severely forward, and then we're also gonna go the other direction with this. So back to neutral, we're gonna go slightly back, moderately back, severely back. So where the shaft is positioned at impact is gonna influence how the golf ball rolls. So sometimes you might notice when you're putting that your ball hops a lot. If you're not putting with a proper loft on the putter, that's what you're gonna see. And when the ball's hopping, it's very unpredictable. It's hard to control distance that way. So we need to run this experiment to see what's gonna allow the ball to roll the best for us. Got it, so what I heard was loft. You know, it could launch the ball too high or too low, make it bounce or make yep. it roll. So the lean of the shaft affects the loft of the putter face, is that true? That is true. So like the loft of the irons, even the putter has loft on it? That matters too. That yeah, matters so too. you know, here would be a putter that's got maybe a lot of loft on it, so you might notice the ball jumps there. Or if the putter is what we call is de-lofted too much, sometimes what happens is if you notice the face of the putter is kind of turned down towards the ground, so when you hit a putt like that, you're pounding the ball into the turf and it hop, 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 and then it starts to roll. So all this hopping is bad for speed control. Oh, it's brutal. Got it. So at the academy, one of the experiments that we run that seems to, like, especially for, for better players, guys mm -hmm. who are shooting in the low 80s, the shaft lean experiment seems to have the most profound impact on them. So having said that, let's see where we go. Here so we go. what are you going to do first? Uh, let's just, let's start with uh, severely back. Like so way back? Yeah. Okay. So something a little outside of the box, right? So here we go. Severely back with the shaft. So you're going to start with the severely back shaft and then through the ball, you're going to try to make it lean severely back as well? Oh, yeah. Do you think it... Well, let's see what happens. I don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> yeah. So if you could notice there, hop, 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 and then it started rolling. Got it. So you actually launched the ball off the turf to some degree, yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I would like... You know, I'm curious now. I would like to see what happens to your ball when you go severely forward. <laughs> Might see some bouncing here too, right? Well, you, never, maybe not. you never know. Yeah, so at home you might actually hit it solid. So, so here's my severely forward. This is the experiment I'm running this time. Whoa, that's severe. That is severe. <laughs> Same thing. So we noticed the bouncing there. Yes. So either way, that just in those cases, there wasn't enough or inappropriate amounts of loft on the putter. Yeah, so neither of those would work very well for me. So I still haven't found what's going to launch this ball at the appropriate angle yet. That's the key is, yeah. So having said that, you did the severes. Where are you going to go now? Let's go right in the middle. So neutral. neutral so is. neutral is club shaft basically straight up and down. Still bouncing. Still bouncing. Getting so, closer. Yeah, so still bouncing. So it, right in the middle, we would think maybe, man, this will be the right one. But it, the ball is the teacher. It's, it's letting us know we're not there yet. Fair? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I wonder... Where should I go next? Where are you going to go? Uh, let's try maybe uh, slightly forward. Let's okay. see what slightly forward does. So slightly forward, everybody. Just a little bit there. Here's neutral. Here's slightly forward. That one sounded the most solid to me. Did you yeah. like the way that felt? Uh, felt solid. And then it looked to me that initially it rolled pretty well. Now there's a drop down from our, our mat here that it made it appear to be bouncing, but the initial roll there was, I thought was pretty good. Yeah, that's what it looked like to me. Yeah. Okay, so at home, we were gonna ask you to play with the different degrees of shaft lean and let the ball be the teacher. So you're gonna get the smoothest roll with one of them. You're gonna start to hit it more solid and you're gonna find out that it's much easier to control the speed. So play around with the shaft lean idea this week at home, get out on the green, see what happens, and we'll look forward to seeing you the next time at the OptiShot Academy.